eager for the kill. Let's see what Quarry's learned from the last match, how much he's improved. Let's see how much is still within Patterson. Forcing the fight, Quarry the aggressor at this moment. Quarry trying to keep punching distance. Joey Bishop just sent me a note. He wants to change his pick. One round doesn't do it, Joey. He had picked Addison. Quarry got to Floyd with a left. Floyd came back and Floyd staggers. Quarry with that left. Quarry coming back, countering effectively to the midsection. I'll tell you, this Quarry's a tough kid. The fight resembled so much the first fight, it's almost unbelievable. That's where Floyd can do his best job, when he has Quarry in that corner. We don't want to labor the point, but it is the fact. Quarry in the red velvet trunks, Patterson in the blue trunks. Squarely in the center of the ring. A minute and a half to go. Quarry getting to Patterson's head, but not hurting him. We saw Patterson come up with that left into Quarry's face after working to the stomach. Quarry finally gets out of that corner. We've got a little less than a minute to go in this round. Fifty seconds left in this, the third round. Patterson against Quarry. The fight is again in the center of the ring. Patterson in the blue trunks is back to you. Now, Quarry on the right side of your screen in the red velvet trunks. A good scrap so far, a good exchange there. All of this coming to you live on ABC's Wide World of Sports. Corey back in that corner. Patterson swinging off balance. A lunge, nothing done to him by Corey there. Now Corey comes through with a good left to the belly and a right to the right to the left side of Patterson's face. We're down to 12 seconds left in this, the third round. Would you like to join my team? The Naxima team. The world's best shaped men all belong. We have a cheer on the Naxima team. Take it off, take it off, take it all off. Sis, boom, ba, Naxima. <laughs> And take it off with Noxima medicated shape. Uh, closer you shape. Olympic Auditorium round four. Patterson against Quarry. No marks yet on either fighter. Patterson down once thus far in the fight in the second round. Almost at the bell. Fighters, I might tell you, are using 10-ounce gloves. 10-ounce gloves. That's by law here in California. Makes it much harder to knock the adversary out when you wear 10-ounce gloves. The rule invokes for safety purposes, after an unfortunate death to a fighter here in California back in 1963. Ten ounce gloves or no, Patterson went down in that second round from Quarry Spitz. Floyd still jogging from side to side. Quarry moving with the left to the midsection. Not a bad fight so far. Got some action. by Floyd connecting. 
We have a minute and 50 seconds left in the fourth round. From the third round to the middle rounds in the last fight, Patterson took command. The one difference between this fight and its pattern and the fight they fought last time on June 9th is that most people at ringside have given Quarry the third round today and have Quarry leading two points to one and in effect two rounds to one. Patterson generally having been considered to have won the first round. Quarry striking out from that corner. Patterson swinging back and down goes Patterson again from the short right. The second time in the fight. We have a minute to go in round four. Patterson down for the second time in the fight. Patterson directly above us. Quarry said he would finish Floyd by the fifth round. This is what he's trying to do. You've got to be impressed with Quarry, regardless of Patterson's glass chin, because this guy is tough. He's got the good left hook, he's got the strong right, and he can take punishment. We have 15 seconds left. Round four. Patterson in the blue trunks. Quarry in the red velvet trunks. Patterson down twice thus far in this fight. Looked good in the first round. here for 68. The Big Steel Cats. Mercury Cougar. Pound for pound. Dollar for dollar. The best equipped luxury sports car in America with a new and deeper V8 growl. Eyes that hide by day, shine by night. A tail that flicks brightly. All standard. This is the royal new Cougar XR7. Rich, glove soft leathers and vinyl. Luxury with claws. Mercury Cougar XR7, one of four proud new Cougars. Lincoln Mercury. Better idea cars from the makers of Lincoln Continental. Back at ringside round five, Patterson against Quarry. Quarry looking a little cocky. You may see him tap Floyd at the end of each round. Why shouldn't he be? He's decked Floyd twice thus far. Floyd sitting passively in his corner during the breathing spell, but looking a little bit tired. Still no marks on either man, although Floyd has been down those two times. Floyd leading with the left and lunging, jumping again to the stomach. Floyd apparently trying to get to Quarry's stomach and then move up to the head as the guard drops, but it's not been working. Not effectively anyway. Quarry has been carefully instructed to try and keep punching distance, punching room. the last round when he decked Floyd with that right for the first time he fought effectively while pinned against the ropes in the corner he really flailed away this is coming to you live you know from the Olympic Auditorium in Los Angeles California Patterson against Quarry World Boxing Association heavyweight elimination tournament as Floyd Lunging, almost completely losing his balance after he had connected with a right to Quarry's head that did not hurt Jerry. Floyd has been doing that, and in the opinion of boxing people, mistakenly so, ever since he was an amateur. It is an amateurish tactic. A minute and 20 seconds left, and this, the fifth round. This was the round Floyd knocked out Archie Moran on November 30th, 1956, at the Chicago Stadium to become the heavyweight champion of the world. It was the round he demolished Ingemar Johansson in on June 20th, 1960 at the then Polo Grounds when he became the first ever to recapture the championship. Now at 32, he fights, well, he fights, I guess, with pride, with desire, because it's what he knows and what he loves. 
but it is no longer the Patterson of those other years. Again the lunge and left himself open for the quarry left. Patterson in the blue trunks. Quarry in the red velvet trunks. Quarry against the ropes. Floyd with a pretty good chopping right against the side of the jaw. 28 seconds left in the round. 26. Another live presentation in the heavy rate ranks from ABC's Wide World of Sports. The end of round five as Patterson lunges and misses again. This, the final quarterfinal.